call them out for their hypocrisy and treatment of the of the royal family and also just point out when uh, telling you've also allowed the biggest gang of internet trolls in history the sussex squad to harass and bully completely innocent folk like Catherine, the Princess of Wales, even when she was suffering from cancer. But of course, we're meant to believe that it's Meghan who is the real victim here. Is Meghan really the real victim? Or is she the perpetrator? Hi all, it's Wise Angel here, and I'm just running a little bit of commentary here uh, over Dan Wooden's live stream. And this is the ginger one about the blame. Dan, about the blame, Elon Musk. For the unrest that in the last few weeks. a lot of online harm the where is Catherine campaign where Catherine was in hospital just as the king was having treatment for cancer choosing of racism sees herself as some sort of role model Maybe your grandmother used to say it too also. If you don't have anything nice to say, don't say anything at all. Maybe Megan should live by those words as well. Maybe if she doesn't have anything nice to say, maybe she should shut that trap, shouldn't she? What's happened? The digital age has almost created a culture where if you don't have anything cruel to say, don't say anything at all. Just speaking about herself again, ain't she? And that is fundamentally changing how we move through the world, how we connect with each other. I think my law agrees with me. You know, as we continue with this work, we continue learning and investing and grant giving to young adults who can be change makers in our view. You mean a fraud maker like yourself, allegedly speaking, of course. Change makers in this space. A lot of it also is how we as adults role model that behavior. How we role model offline, and certainly how we role model online. As parents, we have that responsibility. As global citizens, we have that responsibility. But as a, a global citizen, she thinks she's a global citizen. Hmm. She also thinks she's a legend. Yeah, that's in our own lifetime, in our own head. Citizens, we have that responsibility to model how we want our children to be raised in the world in which. Oh, that'll be the children that she hasn't taken to Colombia with her. Yet it's safe, Colombia is safe enough for pretty twat to go to, but it's not safe enough for the children. Go figure, eh? Them to be raised in, which now includes the digital world. It's not going away, so it's... Are Archie and Lilibet? Really old enough to use the internet alone? Think about the folks. How we can use what we know and continue to push the envelope. Don't think Milo agreed either, did he? Specifically, apologize for. Julie had never been in trouble with the law during a flawless life. But the judge, Stephen Everett, the recorder of Chester, chastised her by saying you should have been looking at the news media with horror. Like every right-minded person, instead you chose to take part in stirring up hatred, so-called keyboard warriors, like you must learn. Well, today, Julie's husband of 29 years, who will now not be looked after, has spoken. 
Is it Megan? Or Myra? Does she go by on X, formerly Twitter? A troll? Isn't she also a keyboard warrior? She laughingly actually outed herself last week. Didn't you, Ah Myra? Actually, fancy naming yourself after Myra Hindley. Get a life, love. Get a life. Speaking to the Daily Telegraph while breaking down in tears. <sighs> And making his outspoken debut, I am delighted to be with a few Montecito. What of course, your hotness and, you know, speaking. Right, I'm going to leave that interview there. But I'm going to try and find the narrative of Mr. Markle. And what he said. Um, about the unrest. And I'm wondering if Elon. will retaliate but I'd just like to show you a picture I've just found on YouTube Harry was with Melania Trump six years ago when this picture was out I don't know if you can quite see it there he was making a kind of gesture. That's not a self-soothing gesture. That is saying I'm a fucking crap gesture. And I'd like people's thoughts on that. Because what was up with Prince Harry's hand during that photo op with the first lady? Was he making a cryptic sign to ward off the devil? That's the kooky theory burning up the internet today. Conspiracy nuts are going wild, speculating about the meaning behind Harry's gesture. And what another question I'd like to pose to you all is, as Harry, has Harry, been the Bohemian Grove? Do you think the elite should have let him there? So, but I'm, what I'm going to do is I'm going to quickly draw some tarot cards um i put the table right first put the glasses on so i can see properly um yeah 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 as my mum say i'm as my mother would say i am a little bit short of lamp oil today so the eyes are a bit itchy because the pollen is a bit woo and war up and down and i need to find a set of cards that i want to use not my normal cards. Now what have I done with the ones I was mucking about with last night? Not those, I'll use these. What I want to know is, is Elon Musk planning to sue the Harold? This is all I'm going to call him from now on, the Harold. Because the Harold gets on my nerves. And shalom, shalom. Good Friday, folks. And my silly dog Milo has just caught a spider. That's one less for me to chase around the house with the Hoover. So, will Elon Musk? Just laugh this idiot off the, off 
the platforms. And his silly little wife. Or will he sue his last ginger follicle out of his hair? Or head? Okay, so we have the star. The star is in reverse, my darlings. We have the Queen of Cups. We have the Page of Pentacles. We have Temperance. We have the Eight of Pentacles. We have the Ace of Swords. To now, that is the only card facing the right way. Harry, it looks as if you're in big bother, Nettie. Okay, what's our star card? Hellbase card. The Eight of Cups and the Little Mole. Well, Mr. Harold, you are a little mole. And you should know your place now. A little mole who lives in a hole. And the Eight of Cups. You shouldn't have said anything. You should be really walking away from what you've said. All these cups are depicted, apart from a couple, is standing upright. The rest of them are over, and you went in that blindly. You were told what to say by the wicked wench of the West. The star, your star is falling. Your cups are emptying quickly, more quickly than you can fill them up. So your star is in reverse. Just where it deserves to be right now. And you were hoping for hope and peace, but your life is in disarray. The Queen of Cups. The Queen of Cups. Oh my god. The Queen of Cups. She is in reverse. This would have been your mother. But she's saying here, you lack compassion, compassion and your emotional intelligence is that of a child. Well, we all know that. You're a man child. And you do whatever Lady Muck says to you. So Lady Muck has obviously told you to say that speech. She wrote it for you and said, if you don't say it, I'll be, I'll be the one that takes your follicles out of your head. Okay, the scratching you can hear is Milo. And now we have the Page of Pentacles. The Page of Pentacles and his lovely peacock. Again, it's Page of Pentacles in reverse. This Page of Pentacles, you... You le you're not learning by your bloody mistakes, boy. You need to start thinking first before you open your mouth and put your foot in it, basically. You used to be the, the one that everybody liked. Pe the kids looked up to you. No, you're no longer that person. And now you have the temperance which is also in reverse. You lack no, you have no boundaries. You lack moderation. You don't know whether you're coming, you're going, you're being, you're meeting yourself in, on the way back. You're being a complete nut idiot. And I'm telling you now, to expect some news. You live in America now. You abide by the American news, uh, by the American laws. And I'd expect some bother coming your way. I would expect to cease and desist. And I would expect, because you've got this gentleman here, the Eight of Pentacles. The Eight of Pentacles is also bringing in, we would say, attention to detail, bringing in some learning. But there's also a spider's web around you. 
The spider's web is also in reverse, upside down. Everything's empty and around you in the pentacles. Your money's falling out. Mm. The web, if it was up, upright, would be catching all of the pennies. You're going to lose this battle. It's not just a battle of wills, it's a battle of the corpse. As you can see, this guy is just sat down at this table and he's drawing, he looks as if he's drawing up plans, he's drawing up um, the legal, the legalities amongst this. And I can see in the not too just distant future, as I've already said, with temperance there and the page of pentacles, you're going to be losing more money than you're taking in. And the little mouse there is saying, look, you're going to end up with one pentacle left. The biggest pentacle will be going off out the door with the winch. Because she's going to leave you high and dry. She's going to take you for every penny. But the lawyer will be taking the other pennies up the top there, emptying them all out of the purse because you're going to get sued for defamation. The Ace of Swords, the Ace of Swords is, you're going to end up with in, in a new relationship. This is upright. And this relationship will be healing and creative for you, but it'll be away from your missus. So this relationship will be coming in next year and it'll be coming for the good oops i've read this the wrong thing i've interpreted this wrong sorry it's you're going to be starting to think clearly and There's a great force coming your way. I think it could be your granddad coming through. Your granddad will be coming through to you and telling you that while he doesn't appreciate you selling those swords, the message is the communication that you thought you were doing with this card, with the Eight of Pentacles. This is bringing clarity to the situation. You are heading back to the course, but not the British course. You are heading to the American course, mate. The Four of Cups. What goes in one hand comes out of the other. And there's the little white mouse and the squirrel up there. This looks like autumn skies. So, mister, your four of cups, you are, you are disconnecting. You lack the ability to think for yourself. You are not getting what you dream of. Things are not coming in quick enough for you. And all, you just dream of things too quickly to come quickly for you but they're not coming quickly and believe it or not a divorce will come quicker than your dreams will come to fruition we have the ten of cups here the house the house move there's two women here and the little cat telling you i told you so there's the bees i'd say this is high grove cottage and this is where you were happiest when you were growing up as a child but this is in reverse all of your memories somebody is a raisin the memories of you is there. You were happy, but you're no longer happy. You're absolutely miserable in the place where you are. And these two women, Milo, be quiet, please. These two women have made your life absolute hell. 
Uh, the picture was the ginger cat. You've got you tied up in knots. And it's time for you to basically get out of dodge and bugger off. Give me two seconds. It's time for you to move on and get out of dodge, basically. Then you have the seven of pentacles, the money tree. This is the money tree. And you need to start making plans for your future and that of your children. But there's a third little sheep here, third little lamb here. There's a hidden child it's hiding behind the person plucking the money off the money tree. Hmm. says if you're patient your money will grow but it'll only grow when you're aware from those two women so the divorce is imminent for you to grow spiritually and physically after elon's finished with you But there's three children there. What's hiding? One's hiding, Harry. Is there something you haven't told everybody? Is there something you haven't told your family? The sun. The sun, I'd say this is interpreting. There's a There's an optimism about you, but uh, with this having the missing child, he, see, this has got the missing child. With this, with the missing child, I'd say this is a missing, the missing child will come forward. There's three children here. And the Queen of Pentacles matches the Page of Pentacles there with the Peacock. The Queen of Pentacles is someone who's very switched on in business. And she knows how to bring money forth and how to keep it and how to make it grow. But this Queen of Pentacles, I believe, is linked to the third child linked to the sun this also could be the sun newspaper about to expose who the third child is and the mother i'd say in around the seventh month next year in july next year we will see a big shift for harry after he's been sued by elon or had his cease and desist and asked to publicly apologize Milo, that's enough. Was, Milo, that's enough. He will then be asked, well, he will then get the shock of his life because he's got more family protection by then. The son will reveal the third child and its mother the world we have the three of cups with three women three children the three different women and there will be a celebration of those three women coming forward they've been suppressed for now, but then three women will come forward and say, we've got these three children. We're not getting them. He can have contact once he's rid of her. What's the last card? The last card is the three of swords. The three of swords is... the separation from the family 
and separation from her. So there is one, two, three, four, five, six. Six, six degrees of separation and the moving on from troubles and better times ahead. So he's going to be moving on from her, moving on from the family, moving on from all his troubles. He's not going to be a vexatious litigant, I believe, any longer. And he's just going to be trying to get back to being Harry again. And he's going to, as I see it, on the bottom of that deck, he's going going to meet those three little lambs the sun is going to expose it all and those three women will be celebrating because they've finally been able to come out of the end of year and speak about the children and harry you done for me it that's all i'm going to have to say on this the ending of this over and out for now Bye-bye.